My name is Boo Lenander. I'm called Busse. I'm coming from Sweden, from Westeros, 100 kilometers west of Stockholm. In my work, I was working for ASEA and ABB as a development engineer in electronics and physics since 1965 long time. I started with the caves also in 1968 and I met my wife also in, uh, in a cave. And she is the treasurer for Swedish Biological Society now. So a lot of my life has been caving. In uh, 2011, my friends managed for me to become a member of this team. They want my equipment up here and uh, I follow them. found it very, very interesting and funny. So uh, I was here with the expedition taking uh, fixed points in the cave with my equipment. I was in Burelven for the first time in 1979. I visited Dulin Lake, put on the wetsuit, found a big stone, be able to see. I was just free diving. I saw this entrance on the bottom. It was only one decimeter high between the sand and ceiling. And uh, it was in 45 degrees angel down into the bottom. Yeah! Oh shit. And uh, that was my experience with Bjurelven. And then it took many years until I was here the next time. I was a sport diver since 1973 and I started with diving and then I came very close to the nature and saw a lot of things that I had never seen before. Yeah. 
ordnar peiling så fort som möjligt. En actually the first cave diving course in Sweden. That was a course in my home. We studied uh, the blueprint of uh, Sheik Exley, which we bought from the United States. That little paper. It was rather funny because I, I was 33 when I found this entrance. I was free diving there in that expedition in 1979. And uh, when I had been diving with cave diving equipment for the first time in that place, I was double up, 66 years. It was a fantastic feeling and it was so beautiful. And I was so thankful to my friends that they have talked to me. You shall die there, you shall die there. I built my first direction finding receiver in 1959. For the cave, I have made waterproof equipment that send a vertical magnetic pulsating field to the surface. I am on the surface with a direction finding receiver to see the direction of the magnetic field. When I find a point on the surface where the magnetic field is vertical, then I'm just right above the point in the cave. Here I find a lot of very nice friends. Beautiful area here. Every day something happens. My philosophy is that persons are made to use their body and to use their brain. An old friend of mine, she says that uh, it will be no moss on a rolling stone. Thank you.